Okay, so, back into the shrine we found last episode. Synced Swing, Moglatan Shrine. Excuse me? This could get complicated. Okay. Nothing behind me? Are you... I feel like you're dying down. I think this thing started on high grav- on, uh, not high gravity, but, uh... Oh, crap. Let's be careful. I think it started at high motion, then kind of moved on. Okay, this looks like it's gonna be kind of a nightmare. Oh, no. Okay, let's... Give that another go, perhaps? Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Off to a good start. Off to a fantastic start. This, uh, seems incredibly awkward, if I'm gonna be honest. Huh? Uh, no! I was jumping forward, but I guess the backward momentum of the swing threw me off. Um, is there a better way to control swings? Stasis, not really. I think I'm supposed to use the Magnesis? Can I, like, run back and forth to make it move a little bit? Is that a thing? Oh! Okay. Um... This seems like it's going to kind of suck. <laughs> this seems like it's going to be kind of miserable, honestly. Uh, let's, let's see. Because, yeah, they don't... It just... It's... Physics feels weird. Okay, go. Huh, there we go. Okay, we just have to accept the really janky, weird feeling of the uh, physics as we go. Come on. This is off to a better start. Okay, yeah. Maybe maybe we got this. Oh. Well, this is problem, you see. Yep. So I take it that wasn't the solution. Oh, right. I can just shoot you. I need to get some regular arrows again. Or any arrows, really. Oh, two of them? So wasteful. We're good. Is that gonna break? The way that it was a series of smaller bricks made me worried the whole thing was going to fall. Ah, oh, it's a forest wall or spear. Do not particularly care. Oh, look at them bouncing over there. It's weird physics time. Um. This strikes me as a nightmare. Okay, I think, what we're, I, think I know what we're going for here, though. Let's try saving first. Oh, no, saving doesn't matter. I start off at the beginning of the place anyway. So I gotta create these, right? Create big physics death traps for myself. Aha! Oh, man. This could go real poorly for me. Oh! Well, tried to go fast, but I didn't, adjust, I didn't adjust the camera correctly and just went careening off. Oh, I'm back here. Oh! Well. This here's gonna be an experience, is what it's gonna be. Wow. Okay, this could be... <laughs> we can do it! 
We can do it. Oh, I have to start the whole thing over. Here's a question. Can I bump into them? Ow. Not even with my shield out? How? How does that hurt me? That's some dumb game logic right there. Okay. That's some real dumb game logic. Got one of you from earlier. That's not really going to count. Eh. Make do, I suppose. Holding your shield out against it should not hurt you. That's silly. You're silly game. Oh, man. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Ooh. Ooh. Can I do this? Nope. Answer's no. In fact, now I'm only in more danger than ever before. Is there a better position I can try? So if I can make it just like balance on here, that'd be fantastic. Ugh! Danger, danger, danger. So I do wonder if I could just hook it around. That'd be kind of amusing. Oh, I didn't quite nail it, did I? Okay, let's try something a little bit. Uh... Is this particularly helpful for me? At aiming this stuff? How does... this work? Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Immediately done with that. Those controls don't even slightly make sense to me. Already done with trying that. Alright. I'm curious to see if I can get this to work, though. Take that, puzzle. <laughs> Alright, now the question is, can I do something similarly dumb with all of them or not? Because that would make me happy, even if it's completely a dumb thing to do. <laughs> I don't need no timing puzzle, I got brain. Yes. Uh, gotta get a little closer. There we go. I think I'm supposed to make them swing back and forth and, and go past them. But this totally works for me, except it's not really working all of a sudden. It won't go any higher, I guess? Why is this one fighting me so much? Well, I could just casually and carefully sidestep it and then just let go of it okay it's swinging way more than it than it really should be <laughs> oh th that one okay we should find our way to that oh oh that almost got me I think There we go. Keep accidentally whistling. I am really amused by the fact that I can just make them wind up on their chain and then they, just, they can't reach me anymore. That's great. That's great. I'm happy that happened. Forest Dweller's bow. That's not bad by bow standards. I don't, don't really have a collection of good bows. What the heck am I going to do with you, though? Do you drop down? You do. Just you, though? I suppose? Crouch, perhaps, to stay on? Okay, we're good. So you guys... Are we doing Catherine right now? We're doing, we're, I think we're doing Catherine. So you don't. They don't move. Okay. That chest is gonna be sneaky, isn't it?
Careful. Sure hope this chest is worth it. Oh, that one on top is going with it. Weird. Was not my intention, but okay. Oh. There's like a towers there's like a Tower of Hanoi thing going on here. Cause I need to stand on the next progressively high thing to continue. Okay. Problem. Uh, can I reach that? Oh! There we go. Okay, so getting out of here is easy, but that's not what I'm, what I'm going for right now. Instead... We're going for this situation right here. Okay, I didn't really mean for that to happen, but okay. Can I make you stick out just a little bit? You go away. Careful. Ho ho ho! I got a thing! Be good. Be a good thing. Please be good. Okay. I mean, a lot of money is a good thing, I suppose, but there's more exciting things to find than money. Um, let's bring you back. I think we're... yeah, we're clear. Oh, or I could just not platform correctly. Hit. What do you do? Okay. That's something different. Um... What do you want from me? Yeah, exciting. Okay, I think I see it. There's a trail of dry leaves going up this path and to the wood that's blocking my path, so I think I'm supposed to make these two things hit each other. Which might be a little hard. Yeah, I don't know about that. Don't know about that. No, it immediately stops swinging, like, right off the bat. I was thinking maybe I could freeze one of them in midair while it's up there, and then they'd both come swinging down simultaneously? That seems incredibly unlikely. Is the stuff above them magnetic? No. Okay. So... I would suppose I probably have to freeze both of them, right? I can't freeze both of them, though. You only freeze one thing at a time. <sighs> Should I save even? Does saving even help me in this situation? I'm thinking maybe I freeze one, shoot it with an arrow, so that it's going to, on detonation, go swinging up, then back down, and then I hold the other one up with the magnet and release it when the other one's coming down, and then they hit each other in midair, and the fire comes down here, and leaves that whole thing being burned. Or I could just shoot it with an arrow, and just burn the whole thing right here, undoing the puzzle. I guess I don't have to solve the puzzle, because this will do this. <laughs> Da na na na! I am curious what I was supposed to do there, though. I think that might have been it. That might have worked if I froze this guy, like with like stasis, shot it with an arrow to give it physics to fly out that way. Hold this one off in that direction. 
Then as this one reaches the peak of it, the peak of its swing, let go of this one. They both swing down and hit each other, collide in midair, cause fire down here. Maybe, I'm not sure. Instead, I've chosen to just completely ignore their existence and just solve it my own way, which is to just use the fire I brought with me. Am I missing anything? The chest back there is the one that had the thing I didn't want. I think that's that. Don't see anything stashed around. They don't usually stash stuff. They usually don't stuff. They usually don't hide stuff in this room. I feel like that's a good contract to establish with the player is to not hide stuff in the room that the uh, final guy is in. Because if you hid stuff in his room, then every single time you solve any shrine, you'd have to slowly look around and maybe there's a chest behind him this time and stuff like that. Or maybe there has been stuff like that and I'm just making a fool of myself because it's totally possible. But I'd like to think that they don't do that because it would be kind of a bummer to have to search every single time because you should just feel like, yeah, I won. My, grab my victory thing and not being like, oh, I got to do homework now in this room. Because checking behind the, shri the shrine every time would be kind of boring. So hopefully that's... So I think, it, assuming that they don't ever do that, I think that's why they did it, was to make that room just feel like a reward and not like a qualified thing. So th that guy, huh? It's gotta be these, right? I can still check the top, though. There we go. Quick rest. Just curious if there's something gonna be like, if there's gonna be something on the very, very, very peak up here. Eggs, they're mine. <laughs> bird egg, a fresh bird egg necessary for making dishes such as omelets and creeps. Creps, creeps, creeps, shit. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I accidentally closed it too. You can snag them from birds' nests if you're sneaky. Nutritious and delicious, perfect for cooking. I always forget how to pronounce that word because it never ever comes up in real life. Ever. To the point where I forgot what it is, usually. It happens. Not a th part of my dietary anything. <laughs> That's right, birds. I rated your young. They're all dead now. Well, actually, they're all in my inventory. Where they are at risk of being forgotten more than anything. Hit. Okay. So my goal is to get it there. One thing I could try is knocking it straight down here, but it seems like it would jump off to the left, which would be bad for me. So I probably want to save. So I can load at least if they all fall down and doesn't pan out. It's like a weird pachinko contest. I kind of wonder if this one on the left is actually... The real trick here. Go. Okay. Don't want to overdo it. There we go. Oh, it's not. <laughs> Let's not go plummeting to my doom. Uh, so going that way would be bad. Because it would go careening off that cliff. But if I want this... <coughs> Sorry. Maybe it <clears throat> went up this left side? Maybe? No. Super not good. That's super bad. Bye! It just left my, my consciousness of existence, basically. Cool. Oh, hi. Big hearty truffle. Years of going unpicked have allowed this hearty truffle to grow quite large. It's chock full of nutrients. When cooked into a dish, it temporarily increases your maximum hearts. Just gotta figure out if there's like a trick to this. That's gotta, that's gotta be down, you know. Maybe it is just a straightforward path. You just hope things work out. I can't see how I could possibly control- I'm on a wall, aren't I? Yeah, I am. I don't- No, no, what, what? No, push it. I don't see how I could possibly control its trajectory at some point. 
No, are you trying to climb? Are you trying to climb walls again? What are you doing? Link, you're bad at this. And I can't really tell what I'm doing, to be honest. Uh, they weirdly fight you on which angles you can push these things on, huh? Alright. Say goodbye to patience. Let's do something lighter, though. No, don't stand on top. Swing. Swing. There we go. No. But maybe a start? Yes. No? How did I get you? <laughs> I don't even know how I switched to that guy. Come on. Yes. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Oh, trick shot. Oh. Not a trick shot, as it turns out. But maybe it landed somewhere where I can follow it? Or maybe it's just gone forever? Are you gone forever? Ah. I'm, I feel like I'm supposed to make those land in here, but yeah. How well do you control it at that point? That's rough. I may have to pass on that one for a while. That could be a that could be an ordeal. How about up here though? What's that? That's a tower from before. What's that? Oops. That's me falling. That's just a tree. Still keeping an eye out for anything that stands out from the uh, landscapes. Hey there. What are you hiding from me, huh? Are you a chest? Oh, it's a core. It's a core rogue rock. They are just everywhere. 25. Oh! I keep dropping them on them now. Look at that! Whoa! We're... Huh. It's like middle left? It's kind of top left. Huh. That's gotta be one of the four beasts, right? Did I solve this one? No, that's way off in the distance somewhere. Interesting. Do I spy anything? Of interest? Perhaps not. That's kind of interesting. That's about it, though. Alright, well. <laughs> Another Korok rock was found, at least. I can take some pride in that? So I talked about reloading my save, but I think I'm just gonna give up on that one Korok seed I saw earlier. I'll label it for later, and maybe I'll come back for it one day. But right now I don't really feel like trying that that roll over and over again. I think the, the rocks are kind of frustrating to use, so I'm not in a big hurry to deal with that. Okay, your metal. Oh. That's a chain. That's a chain. What are you attached to? Oh. This is unexpected. Do I attach you to you? There. And does the other one go over here? I guess I should probably try to run across. So are you the other one? You are. It's a double ball and chain puzzle. What a twist. Can you go in there, please? Do you not fit? Oh, ho, ho. Oh, crap. No, that's not what I wanted either. Oh, maybe the chain was getting tangled because of what direction it was facing? Maybe that's a thing I have to worry about. Ha-ha! 
What if it was two? What if... No, oh, it's only one. But what if it was two? How good would that be? Wow, I'm suddenly finding tons of these. It's almost getting weird, actually. What are you? You have a spear in you? Oh, it's covered in danger briars. Well, I've got an anti-briar weapon. Right? Right. All right, well, no. Hello, silent princess. So I probably have to hover that way. You know what I feel about how I feel about bees? Correct answer. Mine. Uh. Join me, Durians, in my, que in my quest for conquest. So I need that spear. I don't need that spear. I probably don't even want that spear when I find it. But I need it because I can see it, and it's not mine. Which is pretty much the whole reason for most human behavior, if we're honest. I mean, I'm just- I just know who I am. Ah! Rain. Rain, why do you cause misery? Your only reason to exist is misery. You just make people unhappy. Go away. <laughs> is that noteworthy? What is that? Is it just a truffle? It's just a truffle. You might be something. Oh, yeah. I see what's happening here. Uh. Oh. 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 This is a... T this little pond area is dense with just stuff to find. A giant boomerang? This massive boomerang requires two hands. Originally used for hunting, it was modified for use as a weapon. The blades on the inner curves make it a wee bit tricky to wield. My inventory is full. Is it? Oh no, it doesn't count as a bow weapon? Oh, that's disappointing. It counts as a melee weapon. Or, well, weapon, I guess. Just a general category, I suppose. Huh. <sighs> May have to get rid of Thunderblade. Because I want a freaking boomerang. That sounds rad. Neat. Oh. Could have planned that better. I just put a, uh... Just put a lightning weapon in the water. Let's not do that. There you go. Will you suffice? I wonder? The answer is a pretty hard no, as it turns out. Right, I need myself. I need myself a rock. All right, there we go. Center. Oh. Okay. So you, thankfully, you can just walk up that little ledge. Yep. This is the sound of disappointment. Try to point more like this way, perhaps. Oh, crap. No, no, cancel. Yeah. Wow. I am evidently going to get me some upgrades, as it turns out. 27. What is over there? Oh, that's a new flower type, too, huh? But what is this? Just a box or something? Can I climb on you? Oh. I see. I see. Just like before. I've solved it this way before. Oh, I have to get out of the water. I can't detonate it like that. Aha! Glad we, we've established this solution in the past. An opal! A minor reward at best, but it's mine, and you can't have it. Dash. Ooh, more wood for me. Then we've got what? Some kind of pond flower? 
What is it? Fleet lotus seeds. This plant that bears these seeds grows near deep water. The roots draw nutrients from the water, which boosts your movement speed when the seeds are cooked into a dish. More for me. I should get to the coast real quick before I drown. Whew, close one. Chickaloo tree nut. How many plants are there? I'm starting to genuinely get concerned. The small birds love this nut. You can eat it raw for minor effect, but you can also be added to, uh, as a spice. What are the recipes? And I've got to grab all these at the very least because they're all together. There we go. Is that a spear sticking out over there? That is. Is it the same one I was trying to get elsewhere? Or not? Good question. I'll circumvent the lake for a second. Pond. And I'll check over there. That seems like a non... That seems like a, just a random rock. That probably doesn't... Isn't worth investigating. Yep. Aha! Oh, no. That is an X of bees. Aha! I cannot be conquered bees. Oh! Oh! Oh, it's Nocturne Rock. Haven't seen one of those for a while. Oh, they're around here, apparently. Hi. Nice to meet you. Are you a significant sp- Oh, you're being wielded is what's going on. I see. I see. Well, back to my original objective before the rain ruined my day. Yep. Yep. Up we go. Yeah, this is probably the way to go, right? Oh, there's a hole in here. Could that be significant? Forked Lizal Spear. 18. Skilled, li skilled Lizal Fos warriors tend to favor this spear. What it lacks in piercing power, it makes up for with the brutal wounds its dual ribbed blades will inflict. Don't really care about it, but I've discovered it, and that's neat. And there was a truffle in it for me, so that was pretty much the entirety of what I expected, really. Oh my god, I'm gonna die in here. <laughs> I'm gonna die in here. Help. Help. Oh! 